An elementary school that's been a bright spot in Pritchard is facing challenges as the new school year approaches. Pritchard Prep is worried about enrollment in the fall due to coronavirus. WKRG News 5's Devin Wall shows us how the school has made such a positive impact on students. 11 year old Dwayne Prince is showing his dad a thing or two when it comes to playing the drums. Just one of the many things he's learned at Pritchard Preparatory School. It's been a really great year for me. Dwayne just graduated with straight A's and is now headed to middle school. The education is great. The education is the most important thing in your life. You need education to stay smart, helpful, and have good manners. Pritchard Prep is a small, private, faith-based school in Pritchard. The brightest students are accepted here. Many of them live in high-poverty neighborhoods, and their parents believe this school helps them stay out of trouble. Their education is awesome. Dwayne's dad, Ollie, wipes away tears, knowing that the sacrifice he made to pay tuition has been worth it. He does everything that I ask him. He keeps his grades up. He's well-mannered. And mostly, I, I thank this school for that. Parents have to pay $217 per month to have their child go here. And many couldn't pay during the coronavirus. The principal tells me she's worried about enrollment in the fall. One thing that I am worried about once we return to school in the fall is parents going back to work and being able to afford tuition for their students to come to school. Um, we depend heavily on donations as well, so that is another thing that I'm worried about. Attorney Vince Kilborn is a huge supporter of the school. This school's worth saving, and I'm going to help save it. And he would like others to join him. The school, the kids here are on a rocket ship to success. The halls are empty now, but the school hopes to fill them with students come August. I couldn't ask for anything else. So that more families can be part of a school that's raising leaders like Dwayne. Okay, for what's working, with photojournalist Jason Garcia, I'm Devin Walsh. Well, no doubt this past school year was challenging due to the coronavirus pandemic. Teachers and parents had to work especially hard to continue educating students stuck at home. Tonight, our Golden Apple Awards special is saluting teachers who went the extra mile during the pandemic. We're taking a look back at many of the outstanding teachers featured this school year. This year's Golden Apple Tour featured a lot of firsts for our team, including visits to some unusual classrooms. Be sure to join our Bill Riles and our Golden Apple Award team for that special tonight, 6.30, coming up after News 5 at 6. If you miss it, you can also watch that special at WKRG.com.